Dale. Stacy Plaskett Stacy Plaskett lawmakers offer competing priorities for infrastructure plans The Hill's Morning Report. Presented by Facebook, which path will Democrats take on COVID-19 bill? On the money, economy shrank 3.5% in 2020, lawmakers rip Robinhood's decision on GameStop budget rules, politics threaten per hour minimum wage more, D. Virgin Islands on Wednesday became the first non-voting delegate in the nation's history to serve as the House's impeachment manager team when she argued the case for former President Trump Donald Trump show and says Trump team will be very well prepared, after criticism Iowa Republicans seek to cut funding for schools with 1619 project in curriculum capital rioter seen smoking in rotunda arrested Moore's conviction during his second impeachment trial in the Senate. While Plaskett represents the Virgin Islands at large congressional district in the U.S. House of Representatives, she is a non-voting member of the chamber. So, she could not cast a vote in the lower chamber to impeach Trump last month. According to NPR News, she was the only black woman in the chamber on Wednesday. Vice President Harris was previously the sole black woman in the Senate, up until she resigned from the Senate to be inaugurated as vice president. In her statements from the chamber on Wednesday, Plaskett spoke briefly about her journey growing up as young black girl, in the projects in Brooklyn, to ascending to the U.S. House and serving as an impeachment manager. I've learned throughout my life that preparation and truth can carry you far. Can allow you to speak truth to power," she said. I've learned that as a young black girl growing up in the projects in Brooklyn, housing community on St. Croix, sent to the most unlikeliest of settings and now as an adult woman representing an island territory speaking to the U.S. Senate. And because of truth, I am confident today speaking before you, because truth and facts are overwhelming that our president, the president of the United States incited a mob to storm the Capitol, to attempt to stop the certification of a presidential election," she continued. Plaskett accused Trump, who was impeached by the House last month on charges of inciting an insurrection at the U.S. Capitol on January 6, of, deliberately, encouraging the riot. Some of you have said there is no way the president could have known how violent mob would be. That is false. The violence was foreseeable, she said, arguing further that the violent attack was not planned in secret and the insurgents believed they were doing the duty of their president.